In this tutorial, we're going to be setting WordPress on our local host by using Laragon. So the first thing to do is to go to a browser and let's search for Laragon. Now let's jump on the page and we can go here to the downloads and I want you to download the full version. All right, so once the download has completed, let's click on the program, click on it, and let's proceed with installing our Laragon program. So press OK, I'm going to set it on C, next, and just wait for it to finish. All right, so let's run our Laragon. So I'm going to press finish here. And basically, this is the interface of our program. So the first thing that I'd like to do is to click on start all. All right, so now Laragon is activated. So the next thing to do is to install a WordPress file. So right click, go to www. And actually, we need to go to the quick apps. Yeah, let's go to WordPress. And we can call our uh, website, we can call it uh, WordPress. There we go. All right, so let's press OK. I'm going to just wait for it to finish. All right, so we got our website created. I'm going to just go here and let's search for it. So WordPress, there we go, point test. All right, so basically we got it. So this is our WordPress dashboard. So we can just proceed with English. For the size of the title, I'm going to call it WordPress, there we go. So for the username, I'm going to just set it to user. 72 the password i'm gonna just set it to one two three and i'd like to confirm the week the use of the week password for the email let me just user 72 a gmail.com all right so let's install wordpress and basically we got it you can just log in and let's just rewrite those details so user 72 and the password is one two three so let's log in and basically there we go so we are we are in the dashboard, the WordPress dashboard. So from here, we can go ahead and start installing the themes and plugins. All right, so let's go ahead and install our custom themes. So in here on appearances, I'm gonna jump on themes and I'm gonna press add new and it's gonna be uploading a theme so because I already got the file. So I'm putting it here in the download. So you can just double click on the zip file and click on install. All right, so activate the theme and we can go here to the WordPress visit website and basically we got it, we got our website. So it's all installed locally on our local host. So if you'd like to edit your WordPress theme on your local host, so for example, I'm using the Sublime Text Editor, so let me just show you the way to edit this landing page. So basically, if you'd like to edit your theme on your local host, so I'm, I'm using this Sublime Text Editor, you can use any thing you want. So I'm gonna go to File and Open Folder. So basically, we need to direct the Sublime to the folder when we have the Laragon. So previously we installed it on C, so I'm gonna click on C. Here we go, we have the Laragon, double click on it. And the last folder is the www, click on it. And here we have all the, uh, the website that we got, the local website. So our one is the WordPress Laragon, so click on it. And basically we got the files just like if we are on the C panel. So I'm gonna jump on the WP content, and after that themes, and in structure element. So this is a theme that I'm using. I'm gonna click on select folder. All right, so now we have access to this uh, theme. So I'm gonna jump on the front page and for, for example, we can edit, I'm gonna just uh, edit this uh, header. So let's set here, hello everyone, double dash, save, and let's go here and do refresh. And as you can see, we got it updated. So this is the way to edit your WordPress theme on your local host. All right, so basically that's it. So we learned how to install Laragon, WordPress, and how to edit your WordPress themes and plugins. So if you have any questions, let me know. So thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in future projects. Take care.